Hey guys, it's Katakia. Welcome to what I've just found. I mean, I am excited to show you guys this. I basically just started up Attack on Titan before, and um, as I loaded up, I logged in and stuff, and then I found this little button. I clicked it, and the greatest thing I've ever seen on this game appeared. I mean, I did not expect this at all. I mean, <laughs> it is the coolest update the game has had, full stop. Even like when it all changed and became like cool and like all the everything changed and they added the colossal height and everything that was that was nothing compared to this. I mean, they've now added what every fan wanted from the start, which is character customization. You wanted to play as like someone who you could similarly make to you and be able to like slay titans, which is awesome. And they've got all these different like things you can change, which I really liked. Is um, you can change male or female. And the eye type, and they've got loads of different eyes and some cool little custom ones towards the end, like this, like these ones, all dead anime and kawaii and stuff like that, and evil. Stop doing that, and e even more evil and stuff, and which is awesome. Oh, I'm dead excited for this. And then they also change like what you can face, like do his face, so you can have facial. Hair. Stop, Levi. It's like facial hair, and and then it goes to like different mouths, like a little kawaii one, and. All that crap, which and like also like a Joker style one, which looks really cool. Um, and also onto that, you can put like glasses on them from like sunglasses and shit, like stuff like that. It looks awesome. Let's get rid of that. And then you can change your hairstyle. And they've even added more hairstyles, which is really cool. Like bloody mohawks. Go back. Look at that mohawk. That's badass. They just keep going. There's loads. I mean, I'm gonna be able to recreate some anime characters and stuff. Like this is the one I had at the moment, and then. I just like made it a bit brown. If I could do it again, I don't remember how I did it. Let's go. I like that. That's close enough. I can't bother doing too much. I've already made my character at the top. I've already got him here. Wait, did it save? Yeah, it did. If I click load, I can change it. Um, you can also change skin color. There's only two, and also costume. So you can change like what type of um costume your character has. It's just loads of cool ones. But one of my favorite things was. That they added was the ability to change, um, you can take cape on and off, and also the ability to change what team you're from. So you've got like the trainees, you've got garrison, military police, and the survey corp, which is really cool. I mean, that was awesome, like an awesome addition to the game. Never would have expected it to come. And then it was also like point allocations, so you could um, upgrade your character different ways. I'm hoping in the future it becomes like an MMO and you can level up and earn allocation points to make like your speed faster, your gas faster or whatever. Um, but at the moment it's literally just you've got as many points as you want to allocate and you can go to 100 or anything but if I take that off I can go up and you can substitute for stuff like that which I thought was really cool. And then you can also pick what skill we have which is like between all the already ready characters which I think is amazing. I normally play Petra which is that. But let's load my character. Ah, that's what I had. Could the heck a bit better. I don't know, my hair's more blondy brown, so I don't even know. I tried to make myself and it just didn't work. Because they need to add like what color what does what. Because I couldn't figure it out. It helped if they had a box and you could just pick a colour, but for now it's just nice. If it's got everything you'd want in it, which is just like the character awesome character customization, you make them look like yourself, make them look like someone else. Put some cool glasses on them. I want to try and re recreate some um, anime characters and play as them. Like, um, I'm gonna consider doing Kirito from Sword Art Online. But yeah, there's sick, like, sunglasses one. Let's save that. And then you can quit, and you can go just start up a level. And there's all there's your sets of characters at the bottom. I don't know what this is. Cost. I'm guessing costume. I'm guessing it's different costumes for each character. Which is really cool. Let's let's have a look. Petra costumed. Uh, da, 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 start. Oh no! Wow. The get. Wow. I actually haven't done this yet. They've changed the camera angles and stuff. Now this is awesome. Oh my god! By far the best. Um, Attack on Titan update. And they've also changed like how the characters move and uh, controlled and stuff. Oh god, this is this is a lot harder than it used to be. Oh wow, they've changed what Petra looks like. She looks even more badass now. Let's go have a look at this character up here. And now look at that. That looks awesome. They've changed her like eyes. They've... Wow, this is really cool. All the physics and stuff and 
the physics in the capes and stuff now is really cool. Is there a slight bit of physics on the hair? No, it doesn't look like it. They've also added a lot of detail to like everything in general. I mean, what? I mean, look at the um, maneuver gear. It's all customized. It's all like detailed and stuff. How do I? How do I pause this? P. See, so, yeah, let's jump in. Oh, let's see what Petra costume free. See if it actually does give them a different costume. Yeah, it does. Look at that. That is really cool. So yeah, you got new cost like costumes for people, and uh, let's just jump in to City as my character, which is set one, and let's have a look. Any new teams? Nope. Let's jump in. Done. And there we go. Oh wow, the camera is not what it was then. Okay, the car the camera angle's gone back to normal. Um, that's I don't know why it's done that. That's how did I? How's it done? How did I do that then? Camera distance. There we go. That looks cool. You can make some cool machinimas out of this, and oh, this is amazing. Let's max that out, and then this is what we're used to, pretty much. So yeah, that's pretty much all there is on the new update so far that I found. If there's anything else, I'll make it a new video on it. So basically, thank you all so much for watching. Um, make sure you go check out the game. I'll put a link in the description. And yeah, more Attack on Titan will be coming to the channel soon. It's just been a while since... I've... Whoa, that was cool. They've changed the animations and stuff. Let me just do a bit of flying around, see if I can spot anything new like out of the controls. Well, out of what I've seen so far. So let's have it about there. Yeah. Oh, shit. I'm, I'm rusty from this. I haven't played it in a while. And then swing. Okay, it's a lot harder to zoomed in. <laughs> okay, what on earth am I doing wrong? All right, let me jump in. Let's put the camera distance a bit further away. Uh, that looks better. Ooh. I need to get back into this. It's been an absolute long time since I've played. But anyway, yeah, I'm going to end it. So thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to me and call up. Smash that like button. Favorite video if you liked it. And they've also added like swinging animation. But anyway, yep. Goodbye.